I'm Matt, also known as Spade49, and I'm going to teach you how to create a button on Flash. Now, the first thing we want to do is create a f new text field. I'm just call it Play, and add a box. Because if you just have the letters, you'll have a block of text that you'd have to click on the letters, which is really annoying and noobish. So, select it, convert it to a symbol, call it a button. Um, behavior of button and we'll call it play underscore b so now it's a button and now let's just add a stop action in our first frame so that people could actually click the button and we'll add so a little animation so you could see that the movie is playing alright now we are you can do this one of two ways you can put the actions in the frame or the actions in the button. I'm going to show you both ways. I'm going to show you how to do button first because it's quicker and easier. You do on, which states that when the action in the parentheses happens, that the action in the curly brackets happens with it. So that when the mouse is released from the button, this action in the curly braces happens. So we'll have play and close our curly brace. And now we export, control, enter, and you can see we click our button and our little animation plays. You could stylize your button by going, opening it from the library and going, um, there's four states, up, over, and down, hit. And you could add keyframes on whatever you want to change. We could change the text color. I'll show you what this all does in a minute. Now the up, up state is when the mouse is not uh, over the button. Over is when the mouse is hovering over the button. And down is when you click down on the mouse. So we export again and you'll see that these colors change according to their states. And now we could put our actions for the button in the frame by assigning an instance name to this button make sure it's button selected and we'll call it play underscore b it doesn't have to be the same name that you gave to the button but it, it could be anything you want but just make it easy and make sure it isn't a function name in flash like play so we'll go to our frame and we'll put play underscore b dot on release which is when the mouse is released equals function and everything inside this function happens when the mouse is released from play B so play and now we export and our button works and we could say we wanted to add start our animation on frame 5 we would let me just mark this so you know it's frame 5. Not that I'm cheating you or anything. And we want to start our animation at frame 5. So go to and play. And in parentheses, we have, it so it shows the parameters for our action, frame 5. So when you play, it starts at frame 5. And you could also do go to and stop. And it goes to and stop on a specified frame in the parentheses. Control Enter, play, and it stops on frame five. I hope you learned a lot from this, and uh, have fun with Flash.